This is my reaction to The Owl House, season 1, episode 11, Sense and Insensitivity. In the last episode, Luce discovered that the, um, Bat Queen was a palisman. She apparently takes in all other palismans after Albert kind of got cracked and took him in as well. And then Luce had to prove that she's sorry and wanted Albert back and eventually did. Also, Ida's curse seems to be worsening. Um, the elixir is not working as strong as it used to anymore. So, we're going to need to deal with that at some point. Also, this episode starts with an S. So, we got a witch loses? Or maybe it's a witch lose and something that starts with S? Also, if you like full and early directions to the Owl House and other shows that we're at, you can join my Patreon like all these lovely people. The support really does help me out and it really means a lot and makes so I keep making videos like these for you guys on a regular basis. So if you like to help join and support me, the link that is down below. So yeah, let's go. It's a book fair where books come to life. Oh god. Hello. Ah, a fair without rides? Who needs rides when this can take you anywhere? Eh. Yeah. No, same. Hey, you. B, I'm bored. Writer? What? I thought you wanted to be a witch. Of course yeah. I want to be a witch. But where I'm from, that's kind of impossible. So my runner-up dream was to be a writer. Oh. I've had this about the author picture since I was seven years old. I know about <sighs> that angle. I'm going to enter the competition. <laughs> Ugh, what are these basement dwellers doing out in natural sunlight? I know. Um, we're in line for John de Plume. Will you sign my child? I'll sign anything. <laughs> such power, such command he holds over oh. his minions. I must have the same. Another wrinkle. The curse is quickening. Oh no. You, lackey. <gasps> Do you have the item we discussed? Oh, yes, right here. This is excellent. A map to the bloom of eternal youth. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Done. Violence! Is that all you want to see? Yeah. Oh, wait, and? Blood! Hmm. Don't forget guts. Romance. Oh. Ruler's reach. I just made a few tiny edits and this baby is humming. Lusora dies? I know, right? Plot what twist. twist. King, I, I know you're trying to help. I mean, killing my main character is pretty yeah, exciting. Do you to <sighs> ah! Oh no. Not in mud. At least I hope that's mud. I'll read your story. You're reading it backwards. Oh, this? I'll make you as famous as John de Plume. Oh, that's what he wanted. I've always wanted a people chair. I'm in. This will be the first step in my reclamation of power. Then all you have to do is sign here. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Damn, enter the bad boy. Like two authors mashed into one. <laughs> Damn. Oh, really? Like it? Oh, oh. Ooh. Oh. Lily, Edelin, coming along or finished? Bam! <laughs> Rulers reach two. Now with more swears. Oh, yeah. Splendid. <laughs> now with more swears. Oh, you can't. Not only are you a great writer, but a practical joker as well. That's true. Oh, what? what? Oh, this is truly awful. Looking forward to the real draft. Damn. I'm not writing for you after you made fun of all my ideas. Hey, what the heck? Congratulations Damn. on your hard-earned success. What am I gonna do? I can't write without her. Hmm. Oh. Well. Ah, does this remind you of how we used to race to the kitchen, Lily? Lily? 
Oh wow, good cut. Right, back off. That yeah, I was gonna say. Why are you always like this? Because Lilith, you think I'm just some tired old biddy. Ah, but I'm more than that. And with the bloom of eternal youth's power, I'll show you. What the? Ah. <laughs> Oh, it was the guy who sold it, though. No. The map. Without, without your writing, partner. Oh, God. Bruce! That snappily dressed lizard trapped me in this shrinking box. Oh, no! You'll recall you are under contract. <laughs> Great. Make your deadline. Or you'll never be able to hold a pen again. Just like. Help me! No! Oh no! Oh no! All I wanted was to write a dumb story with my friend. No. Luce, you're living your dream. You're becoming a witch. But this celebrity is as close as I'll ever get to my dream. It all went to my head, and I hurt you. I'm sorry. Hey, being with you is one of my favorite parts of this dream. Oh. I have a plan, but we need to work together. To and now that I have led you to my nest, I'll suck all the life out of you to satisfy my unending hunger. He scammed us. Can you believe he yeah. scammed us? I thought there was a 50 50 chance going in. What is this all about? The light spell. Oh. Ah, I just realized I should have said enlightening. Skip to the first <laughs> You'll find it. <laughs> You'll find it enlightening. Pretentious scarf, go! I made you a star. And this is how you repay me? No. This is. Hey, cube minions. Oh no. Oh. Huh? King. I am your biggest fan. And I fought my way back here for you to weed my story. I'm sorry. My lawyer advised me not to look at unsolicited work. But but Ugh. If I read this, will you go so I can annihilate them in peace? Of course. You're going to love it and you're going to sign. And then they're going to be accused eventually. Join me in the Emperor's Coven, Edelin. He could even heal your curse. Why should the Emperor be the one who gave her the curse in the first no, place? I'll heal it on my own terms. I don't want to owe him anything. Catch I'm just trying to figure out who gave her the curse. Not if I catch you first. Could be Lily. Could be the Emperor. I don't know, I have no idea. See you around. Nope, I don't know nothing about that. We hate books. Well, look at the time. What's a book? Good night. <laughs> Huh? What the? <laughs> Girl, you do not want to know. Yeah. Now, my reaction to The Owl House Season 1, Episode 11, Sense and Insensitivity. So, Ida went off on the woods to try to find a bloom of eternal youth, and Lily also went and retired on a race there to get it, and then found out with a trap, and they quickly defeated the guy who set them up. And they did bond along the way. Lily did say she wanted Ida to join the Emperor's Coven of her own free will rather than having her take her there. Also, Luz and King started to write a book. However, then King took over and sold it and became famous. However, the publisher was evil and trapped him in a cube until they wrote a sequel. And then they tried to break the contract. And then the little um, person whose name I forget um, came in with their story. And she's like, oh, read mine. And then he did. And he's like, oh my god, this is great. And now is signing her instead of King. So they got out of it. So yeah, that's it.